Welcome back to the Story Report. This is our monthly real estate update where we talk about everything and anything happening in the Toronto real estate market. Right, we're gonna jump right into it as it was another month of headlines. And if we look at the detached and the semi-market in the 416, detached average price around 1.436, which is actually down 5.6% year over year. Now semis, a little bit better, they're right about par at 0.3% increase, just over a million dollars. Now it's worth noting that since the beginning of this year, those prices are way up. So those numbers are a little bit deceiving. Now let's look at the townhouse market and the condominium market. For townhomes, your average price was $741,000. That's about even from at the same point last year. And your condo market was at $600,000 in the 416. That's a 6.5% increase from at the same point last year. So I'm gonna keep in mind because Cam and myself sell a lot of condos downtown. And the average condo price downtown in CO1 and CO8, which is really the downtown core of the city was actually $700,000. So it's a big jump up when you want to be in the core of the city. Right now, another big headline this month was sales are way down and also active listings are way down. So it's worth noting that we're comparing this to the crazy point last year, fair housing rules had just kicked in on April 24th and people wanted to list their homes in May. So those numbers are a little bit deceptive and we're going to wait to see some month over month trends before we start making big conclusions. Now, it's also worth noting that active listings are currently up 13.2%, so houses are taking a little bit longer to sell. Average days on market is 20, so there's still a, little, a couple of variables to take a look at when looking at those year over year numbers. One thing that really stood out to me from the numbers that came out for May of 2018 was that your average list price to sale price was at 100%, if not higher than that in every single asset class, me, asset class basically meaning that you know if you listed your house for $100, you are going to get $100 or more. And that's something that's very positive moving forward into this market. That's right. Now we've got a couple of housekeeping items to take care of before we wrap up. And the first one is go vote. June 7th is the provincial election. And I don't care who you're voting for. It could be the Purple Party. Just go and do it. It is your obligation as a citizen of this awesome country and province. Now the biggest event of the year in our minds is coming up. The Story Team's annual client event is happening July 19th. We haven't released all the information yet, but look out for the invites coming soon. Tons of details coming soon, and as always, thanks again for watching this month's edition of the Store Report. We'll see you next time.